seeing out of the rest of the, the defensive line kind of as you worked as a unit here throughout fall camp? Can you repeat the question again? Yeah, uh, what, what have you seen out of the defensive line as you've gone through the first two weeks here at fall camp? Oh, a lot of energy. And that's across the line. Go from Carlos just doing his thing, always being a sessional, Mick, um, being Mick, being great. And everybody under us is bringing the energy that we need for this defense. Do you feel like the second unit's pushing the first unit? Oh, yeah, definitely. Nobody, I want to say, no, yeah, nobody's safe. Some, somebody can't be replaced. So the first unit has always, has to always be on, be on their game. Is this the most confident you've been in a defense and since you've been here? Or more comfortable? I'm more comfortable. I'm very comfortable in the position where I'm at right now because I know the scheme. I know what Coach Yaka wants me to do, and I know what the D-line wants me to do. Which is? <laughs> uh, terrorize the quarterback and <laughs> stop the run. Week three of camp, like what is the mindset? It kind of gets to the point where you know you're ready for the game. You still got over two more weeks to go after this week. Uh, the mindset is to keep going, no matter how bad you feel. Just keep going because at the end, well, if this is not the end, the end is at the end of the season, trying to play for the big championship, trying to play for the big ten. And if we have our mindset saying, thinking, "Hey, fall camp is almost over and all stuff," so we won't have that drive to be, get there, if that makes sense. Is your drive getting there getting a little bit more hungry? Oh, definitely. Definitely. Um, the older I get, the more wiser I get. I see, I'm not seeing things from my point of view. I can see things from other point of view, and I can see the heart that everybody plays with. Does tight end seem like eons go to you now? What's the tight end? <laughs> yeah. <right. laughs> Point, point being, you've come a long way, though. Since oh, yeah, here. definitely. Has it paid off for you? I, I believe it definitely has paid off for me. Um, I'm very grateful that I had the opportunity to switch, too. Do you feel like you are more comfortable with this position? Oh, definitely. Um, oh, go ahead. Why is that? Why? Because it's just great coaching staff. I know, and coming in and playing defensive end, yeah, it was kind of, I was kind of lost in the beginning. I had great players like Malik Khan and Vince to help me out and all. And I took the lessons that they gave me, and I'm helping out our players now. I want to talk about the coaches, coaching staff's energy and their youth and their cohesiveness. Do you kind of feel like Perella and anybody else on that defensive staff, their energy kind of rubs off on you as a player? Oh, it has to. You have to have the energy that the energy or in the intensity they have on the field because you will see it if you don't. Like, coach will call you out, hey, pick it up. We need to get going. You have to, you have to be on, on the same energy level. So, yeah, it's definitely transferring. Would you say that's, like, maybe increased since you first started playing D-end here? Yeah. Um, John Perla is a great coach, and Coach Diaco is also a great coach, and they're very energetic, very energetic. How good has this defense been this fall of getting hands on footballs? Oh, deflecting or whatever. Oh, we've been good. I think everybody's vertical part has increased by two inches, though. But it's been really nice, and we all have a call that we say, and you can probably hear in practice, and it's been it's been great. You mentioned terrorizing the quarterbacks. Is there a different way you have to do that, or is your position more similar than not to what you were doing last year? There's different techniques since in the three four, and how should I say this? It's different, but it's the same at the same time. There's certain things I can still do, and there's certain things I had to learn and perfect to still terrorize the quarterback. How's this offensive line seemingly compared to the previous ones as you attempt to terrorize this, that quarterback? Oh, this offensive line is really good. He, I'm, they really made me better this year. And from Nick Gates to DJ Foster to Neville, they're really improving. And I can't thank them enough because if I didn't, if they didn't give me a good look or they didn't practice well, I know I won't be getting better. So definitely I want to thank them for that, and we're just going to have a great season.